The message of the cross says the weak became strong. The message of the cross says the servant is the Lord. The message of the cross says the one who became nothing became the savior of the world. Jesus changes the entire way we reason. It doesn't sound like human wisdom. He does it. How can a person who brought an entire kingdom say he's a servant? It makes no sense. A king of a kingdom says, I will die. It makes no sense. Not in the world which man's wisdom teacheth, but that which the Holy Ghost teacheth. When somebody dies like a criminal, and then is exalted to the highest place it doesn't make sense so that jehovah of the old testament the man they saw it doesn't make sense abraham had seen it jehovah the lamb the lamb the king is a lamb it doesn't make sense that's why john in his vision said behold the lamb of god that take it away the sins of the world after a while john said go and ask him is he the real one or should we look for another because it doesn't make sense that you say you are a king who brought a kingdom and you're going to die by the people you are supposed to rule <laughs> what kind of kingdom it doesn't make sense then jesus said to you the lowest form of persuasion to communicate to john the lowest you know miracles are the lowest form so he opened blind eyes made the lame to walk he said gentlemen blind eyes see the lame walk go and tell john what you see and what you hear the lowest form say believe me for the very works if you don't want to believe me for anything else believe me for the very work sake that i do when much you got hold of this truth because all of them were in the same class they didn't understand they couldn't fathom it was after resurrection when much you now understood look at how much you will put it matthew chapter 8 verse 16 when the evening was come they brought unto him many that were possessed with devils and he cast out the spirit with his word and healed all that were sick why next verse that it might be fulfilled which was spoken by Isaiah as the prophet saying himself took our infirmities and bore our sicknesses what he's saying is that all the prophecies were fulfilled when Jesus by healing indicated that he will be the one to heal the disease of our spirit so he healed physically as a pointer to his spiritual healing of us so the miracles of jesus and the signs in the gospels we are pointers to the ultimate miracle which is the regeneration of the spirit of a sinner so we must not see jesus trying to show power when he heals he does not heal to show power he heals to demonstrate service he heals to minister and to serve it's not a display of muscles in the healing of jesus we must see his compassion that he could humble himself to the womb of his creation he could humble himself into the womb of his creation is the message of the cross we see the servanthood of God.